Dear Minister Logar, ladies and gentlemen, dear friends, the pandemic continues to uproot our lives in Europe and in Latin America. Nevertheless, in our daily struggles with the virus, it is also important to focus on the good news. More and more vaccines are being produced and shipped around the world. The European Union is the main supporter of the global vaccine platform COVAX. During the last weeks, COVAX has sent millions of vaccine doses to more than 100 countries, many of them in Latin America and in the Caribbean. Also, economists now expect the world economy to recover more quickly than predicted in the first place. The International Monetary Fund recently increased its 2021 growth forecast for both Europe and Latin America. We have to make sure that this recovery happens evenly between within all nations. As today's conference shows, Europe and Latin America are natural partners in this effort to build back better. Together we can shape the boost that the pandemic has given to the digital transformation. A new submarine cable between Brazil and Portugal will soon bring our digital spheres closer together. And we are continuing our work towards the European Latin American connectivity platform. We must also make this a green recovery. Companies from Chile, Germany and Italy are successfully working together on developing green hydrogen. Today you will discuss the experience that Slovenia has to share in sustainable forestry and water management. Finally, we have to strengthen our trade relations. We remain committed to the European Union agreements with Mexico, Chile and Mercosur. They remain important to setting standards for social, climate and environmental protection. On all these issues, we made progress during the German European Union Council presidency last year. And so I am very happy to see that our Portuguese and Slovenian friends are building on that work this year. So let's continue these efforts. Let's join hands to hopefully create more good news. Thank you very much.